Good morning, boys and girls. Mr. Snell coming to you from my front yard today. Uh, it is April 3rd, and we missed a bunch of birthdays yesterday. Our birthdays yesterday were Logan, we had Killian, we had Nora, and last but not least, Shania. So happy birthday to those students yesterday. We are going to, I'm not gonna do today's workout here from my front yard. I'm gonna talk about it. Um, but what I also want to do is I want to challenge you guys this weekend to get out and do something in your yard. Now, there are all sorts of things we can do in our yards. Um, when I was, I think, nine or ten years old was the first time that my parents let me mow the yard. Yes, I say let me. They didn't make me. I wanted to mow the yard. I saw my dad out doing it. I want to do that so bad. So I begged and begged and begged to let them, uh, to have them let me mow the yard and finally when i was nine or ten years old they said i was big enough i could mow the yard so that means that if you're about a fourth grader you probably are getting to that age that size too so uh, something you could do mow the yard for your parents um, there are a hundred other things maybe not a hundred there are a lot of other things that you could do in your yard where uh, you could be out getting some exercise so what i want you to do today is down in the comments down below leave me a message as to what you could do out in your yard that would be considered yard work something where you are getting exercise something that gets your heart rate up or, or moves your muscles or makes you stronger or even just wears you out at the end of the day and the other thing the other great thing about being outside is you're outside in the sunshine okay we're out there we're, we're getting some some sun getting some vitamin d on our skin and it's all good for us so uh, let me know what you're gonna do. But for right now, I'm gonna head inside. I'm gonna do our workout. Today our workout is uh, 90 second jump rope. Now, I had the question the other day. Comment on my video from the other day when we had jump rope in there. So if you're doing jump rope and you don't have a jump rope, how can we do jump rope? Well, you can uh, jump over and back over an imaginary line. If you can find a crack in your sidewalk or driveway, you can jump back and forth over that. You can go side to side. You could change it forward and backward, side to side. Another thing you could do, you could just do jumping jacks. Uh, do 90 seconds. So today, 90 seconds of jump rope. 32 plank touches today. Uh, that is where you're in the plank position. You reach up and you touch your opposite shoulder with your hand. Then do the other hand. Reach up and touch the opposite shoulder with the other hand. And do that. Try to keep your body as steady as, as possible while you're doing that. 45 second wall sit is next on our list. So we're going to sit against a wall like you're on a chair. And the only thing holding you up is your muscles. Leg muscles, back muscles, all of that. So then uh, next, last but not least, 20 arm circles forward and 20 arm circles backwards. Now, uh, if you do these nice and slow, you take your time, go nice and easy, those arm circles will start to really uh, make, your, make your arms exercise, strengthen those muscles. Anyway, boys and girls, hope you're doing good. Leave me a comment down below about what kind of outside activities you can do in the yard, help your parents, keep your yard nice and pretty, and also it's exercise. All right, boys and girls, I will see you next week. Thanks for watching. Remember, stay fit, stay healthy.